All right, so I was streaming without my mic on over the weekend because I was hanging out with my husband and talking. So anyway, um, every time that people go in my house, like stuff flies off of the furniture and falls through the floors and stuff, which is really sad because I spent way too much time doing this. But I wanted to make a quick tour of my house for anybody who's interested since I don't expect anyone to sit down and watch me uh, place things for like 12 hours in the archives. So, firstly, we'll get a little perimeter, put some turrets here, I'm gonna add the flag up there, these are my flamingos, another turret here in Codsworth, so you can kind of see I made a big uh, outer wall. door here. I moved a chem station in here. Some generators. I might eventually put some stuff in these little alleys. I haven't yet though. Here's dog meat. Let's see if he'll do a trick for us. Everything okay boy? Alright, well he's not my companion at the moment, so well Come maybe on, I can boy. take him time to go. Oh, I don't want to do that. Great. Hey. How you doing, buddy? I messed that up. Hey, boy. You know any tricks? <laughs> oh, dog meat. Has a favorite teddy bear. Good boy. Alright, so I think he's my follower now. Which is good because Codsworth judges me, which I wasn't expecting from a robot, so... I do still need to do some quests for Preston so that I can have him as a companion, just so I can take his colonial duster, because that's fucking awesome. Alright, so, here's my front door. Let's take a look. Right away on the inside I have my big general dump of stuff. Oh, looks like I got a coffee cup on the floor randomly. So this is one of my treasures. Giddy Up Buttercup, who I have renamed Giddy Up Atrax because he's always like sinking halfway through the floor most of the time. You know, like from the never ending story. So anyway, uh <coughs> some paint. This is my office. I put uh Whoa, dog meat. It's an interesting stretch. Okay. Uh, put like letters that I find and stuff in here. I don't know. I do that. I'm weird. I kind of put different things in different containers sometimes. I used to be really, really crazy. Like in my fridge would be where all the aid was and blah, blah, blah. But I'm not quite, quite that bonkers anymore. Just this is more my like dump of permanent dump stuff. Because like this is like weapons that I might switch out and aid that I want to grab. So it's my quick dump spot. So it's my kitten poster painting naturally. Some other random stuff around. I had a really hard time getting things to like stack on these shelves. So they look kind of janky right now because a bunch of stuff like flew off of them every time anyone entered my house, which is like every five seconds. So I just picked it all up because it was really irritating. This is my little countertop. There used to be a cute little like scene here, but everything kept flying off and so again I just sort of picked most of it back up. Here's my little living room. Blast radius. Pretty mountain painting. Red stag over my couch. This is my little dining table, all of that. Here's a little workshop, which looks like my generator is only powering one of these lights. I must have put it in a weird spot, so it's a generator like up on the roof up above. I'm not that concerned about it. <coughs> so that goes out the back like I had showed you before with Dogmeat's house and all that stuff. And then the second floor, 
which thankfully nobody really comes up here, the settlers, because I would be really upset. So this is my bedroom. Some uh, overdue books. Toy rocket ship, alarm clock. This is my safe, which is where I put the treasures that I find. I use the term treasure pretty loosely. I'm little bonkers and collect a lot of things in the game, like sweet rolls, toy cars, that sort of thing. Just weird stuff that I find, like any weird costumes that I don't see all the time that I find particularly funny, I'll put in there. So we've got a teddy bear, comfy pillow, another kitten, of course. This is the best painting. And by the way, I'm gonna like recreate this painting and put it in my house. Like, for real. It's amazing. Look at this kitten. He's like chewing on a rocket ship. And I see this painting in different sizes all over the wasteland and I always like pick it up if I can and it never like goes in my inventory like in a way that I can put it. Like I found a lady who was like dead and she was like clutching a tiny desktop picture frame with this kitten. And I was like, oh my god, I'm totally putting it in my house. But it, it ended up just being blank when I took it back out of my inventory. Here's a Jingles the Moon Monkey. I'm actually terrified of monkeys in real life, but uh, Jingles the Moon Monkeys are pretty cute, so... These guys are hanging out watching the TV. It's my little balcony. I love this wallpaper. The Space Monkey wallpaper, so that's kind of... was the catalyst for collecting the Jingles the Moon Monkeys. But I mean, really, is anybody not collecting the Jingles, the Moon Monkeys? I don't know. I doubt it, so. But in any case, looks like, again, some of my lights aren't working properly at the moment, but that's okay. Don't ever come out here, really, anyway. And here's my disco ball, of course. Some ambiance. And yeah, that's my house. I'm, uh, gonna take a screenshot.